<laughs> How y'all doing today? Welcome back. Um, so I had a mantra from yesterday, um, yesterday, March 8th, where, um, I was, you know, I was talking about, um, hey, what was I talking about? Um, I forget. I'll check it. I'll check it. I'll check it a little later, but, um, Oh, it was about being grateful. Being grateful for what you have, you know. And then I also kind of prefaced a little bit what I was going to talk about today. So, um, I was talking about focusing too much on the past. So, my mantra for today is just that. Don't focus too much on the past, but also don't focus too much on the future. Focus on how you're going to get to the future presently if that makes sense what i'm trying to say is you know you're too worried about the past doing th like worrying about things that are out of your control things that you can't change now things that you can't do anything about that has already happened and it's the history but then you're also focusing on things that haven't happened yet that you also have no control over Unless you do something about it now in the present. So. It really is like. You can use what you had. What happened in the past. You can use that as motivation. Just don't. Don't. Dwell too much on it. Don't think. Don't think about it too much. <laughs> like the Drake song. Don't think about it too much. <laughs> Too much, too much, too much. <laughs> yeah, don't think about it. don't think about the past too much. Um focus on the things that you can control now. Which also means don't focus on the future too much. Focus on everything that you can do right now that's in your control right now. The things that are important to you right now, the things that you have, the things that are there for you are always going to be there for you. Otherwise, it wouldn't be there for you. Otherwise, it's not for you. <laughs> so the, what is for you is for you. But you have to decide what is really what it is, really is going to be for you. And you can't do that by looking too far in the past and looking too ahead too ahead in the future. You're gonna miss what is cut, what is right under your one of your nose, right in your face, right between the ears, <laughs> or right on the outside of the ears, I should say. And you're gonna miss out on all the opportunities that you could have, right in your face. So I feel like people just get too caught up in the past. I mean, we all do, you know, because the past, it affects the future and it affect, it affects the present, which affects the future. So essentially the past affects the future. Although that might be true, it does not define you. What happened to you in the past does not define you, you know. We all evolve as a people over time. So where you were back then, the stuff that you did back then was probably the best you could do at that time. If you were in that situation now, it's not saying to go back on that scenario back in the past dwelling on it. But it's to say, if you were in that position right now, you probably wouldn't do what you did. You know? And if you would... Sometimes, you know, that's not so bad either. But if it's something if it's something that affected you that much, just think about it like this. You overcame all of that. You went through all of that to get to where you are right now. All of that made you who you are. 
but it did not define you, if that makes sense. It seems like it's similar, but if you understand, it's different. All of that stuff made you who you are today, but does not define you. It does not define who you are as a person. You know, you are much more than the mistake, than the worst mistake that you ever made. You are much more than that. And you are much more than what opportunities are in store for you in the future. You are much more than that. You are also much more than the person that you are in the mirror. You are also, you are so much more than that. Just remember that. My mantra is, don't dwell in the past and don't look into, don't look too far in the future. Focus on you right now. Love y'all. Peace.